so welcome back guys to another video and in this tutorial i'll show you that uh, how we can log into our system or app so you can see i changed the layout of activity start you can see the start activity there's you know action bar you can see because i added uh, these lines in style values that is new style this name no action bar so windows no action bar and in the manifest file I did this line at theme no action bar so you can see there's no action bar and from here it is if there wasn't uh, it's it's something look like it. after removing the action bar it looks like this this is what I was talking about so I also changed the some little bit of the registration to text me put a password email and person name and you can see the, the volumes are something like this. I change the background here and oh a big change I will change the all colors that's three colors the color primary I changed to the little blue and it's to dark blue and this color is stable brown so our next step was creating a new activity that named and naming it to login activity okay let's click on finish and now we have to wait the, till this finish so let's design the layout let's use linear layout oh what's it logo error oh i also changed the logo because it was a little fantastic so I simply great let me reflect it okay now this is now change it to linear layout okay. now since again since again we'll fix this problem now this law is something like this so that's pretty good come back to point let's click on preview it will be not okay so let's let's create to email or we can say here logo let's use logo emails view to that contains instead of content we use 150 dp 150 dp and the search the sums and this is going to be drivable this logo okay that's it oh sorry this is logo as you can see that's the drive lower still not signed because i don't know what's missing so let's fix the and let's send this gravity to center and add the layout margin top to 50 db let's use 50 db and this what's wrong with it this is linear layout vertical so this position is going to be vertical now you can see the difference not very top 13 dp okay that's it now looks something well and now we need a text input layout to for the email and for the password let's see where the design and text input layout another text input layout we got two input layouts change to rep content same here okay now we also need a button to log in the user so we got our things so let's say let's do little changes here 5 dp 5 dp and it's going to be 10 dp oh yeah so turn this text to login okay and it's hint to password and it's into email okay that's it 
that's it now we can do something a little bigger so let's change these ids so this text input layout to input log email and same here this is going to be pass and this button log okay that's it so let's let's come to login activity java and now we have to create the variables for the each item so private text input layout input email and input to pass and a new profile look button and so button is going to be button login okay that's it let's add a new private so let's do it later so here we need the input email equal text input layout and find you by the r dot id dot input put log email and input pass to text input layout and find where dot id dot input log pass okay now this one last thing this is button and this is find you by id r dot id dot button log that's simple so that's we got our thing so let's add a listener for the login button so simply type type in button log dot shade on click listener new on click listener so it creates automatically the on click listener for our button so simply create a new method and name it to name it to private void sorry private void log in okay that's it it can you can make it public so any activity can use this so but i'm not doing this right now so let's add some string values set a string email and string pass okay that's it it's the blue ord so now we have to create the login so let's use if sorry if text util is utils dot is empty of we'll do it later let's string l email and it's going to be input email dot get edit text dot get edit so that sucks edit text dot get text dot to string and so let's string it so extra service will be removed and string l pass equal input pass dot get edit text dot get text dot to string dot ring same here and l email so and end text utilities dot it's empty of l pass so whenever it only works when the text is not empty so let's use login and this is going to be l email and l pass so now we can create it so let's add a progress dialog here dialog equal new progress dialog this set equals dialog dot set message logging logging in please wait okay that's it so now we can do is progress dialog dot show okay that's it so now we have to create a firebase auth function so we'll use private firebase auth and we also need a so we also need a database reference for our database so simply use database reference so f 
we don't need it here so we'll do it so we don't need it here so let's say effort equals fire result dot get distance okay that's it so now at the effort dot sign in with email and password it needs email and a password so we'll email and password so now we are going to add on complete listener for this so we be we using add on complete listener for this so let's use if when the task is successful it returns this value to successful so else it's going to so toast so first dismiss the dialog here and then then a new toast toast with the error so it's going to be error but the and then you space under the task dot get exceptions dot get the message so here the again a toast as i can sign in success full hope it works so and the spelling successful okay that's it length short length long okay now we are going to so the intent of main activity let's reflect it to main intent equal new intent what is it login activity dot this comma main activity dot class and start intent main intent and finish this activity by using finish and we are going to add a new bake button here before doing let's add a name for here so it's so label is going to be signing okay let's reflect it with a string signing okay now let's use get sport action bar dot set display on my true the next thing we have to do is simply add get sport action bar dot say display show home enabled so this is it and uh, that's simple here that on option side i'm selected return it with true so let's return true okay now switch item dot get item id yes android dot r dot super android dot r dot id dot home so simply finish this finish and break this method so this let's do the same thing in the register activity so simply select these and then press if you're in, if you're using windows simply hold alt and shift then select this you can see the both items are selected now simply copy them by control c now space them here so we don't need this method here so we are expecting it to here okay that's it let's see if thing so everything is fine so let's test your app in a real device so guys we forget a method so let's implement it in the start activity so there's a login method is empty so that activity is intent log intent equal new intent there's a start activity dot this to login activity dot class and start activity sorry start activity to log intent and let's reflect because the user sign in the ratio activity is in user sign so that must be at here so let's if by right click here and then click on the track then move to the dot user sign okay reflect you can see this is reflected in this so this both sign in methods are here so let's test it in real 
so that's it we got our app at here simple not set you can see the uh, logo is changed <laughs> so like, we are opening you can see the welcome to simple notes as we change this layout at here you can see the same so we also oh, already have account so now we have to shine in so let's sign in we are using test so let's use test test with the test what was it test 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 and this the password it was password so let's PAWS password okay that is the password so let's try to log in you can see the we are looking login button we can what the so we got error it says attempt to invoke word all method and revisit edit text on an L object reference so let's try to fix this oh everything is what's wrong text input layout text input edit text text input layout and text input text let's locate let's see locate and on a little object reference attempt to invoke on an object reference what was it this is input pass we already defined it here let's so what's wrong let me fix this issue so guys the problem is at input pass because the input pass is in the registration activity so we have to change it with input log pass so this is the fix of the problem so let's start our app so you can see this is working you can see this already have account i'm change i get sudo not in sudo this was test at the red test dot app and password was i mean uh yes pass, password was password so let's try to log in sign in successful you see the sign the user is signed in and if you try to go back you will come here so this is it what's wrong with it so we also have to finish the activity so need a new account works well and already have account also works well so thanks for watching in the next part we will try to create a note or so next part we create we try to create a note and put the note to the Firebase database. So there's enough in this this part. So I'll see you guys in the next part. Thanks for watching.